A South Carolina lawmaker is renewing calls for a statewide hate crime law, despite new numbers from the FBI showing that hate crimes are down. News News' Riley Benson joins us in studio. Riley, Representative Wendell Gilliard says that report shows disturbing flaws in reporting these crimes statewide. Brendan, the hate crime report from the FBI shows the number of reported crimes was down in 2021, but Representative Gilliard says the Palmetto State is experiencing the fastest growth of hate groups in the country with 17 active groups statewide. Representative Gilliard says the FBI's report is flawed and even though it shows hate crime numbers are down, he believes several hate crimes are failed to be reported, skewing the numbers in South Carolina. Now, the renewed call for hate crime legislation in South Carolina is seen as a way to identify the true number of hate crimes in our state. Representative Gilliard believes it would help to reverse the growing trend. The Low Country representative began his fight to bring the legislation to South Carolina after the shooting at Mother Emanuel. And when you look at the history of South Carolina, when you look at the Walter Scott, the Mother Emanuel, and so many other in-betweens, you know, it, it, you know it, once again, it doesn't take a rocket scientist to, to say that, you know, we need a hate crime law. Now, we're on, uh, the, you know, we're making progress again. We're trying to go ahead, and I have pre-filed the bill uh, for next year's session. Representative Gilliard believes the bill will again pass South Carolina State House of Representatives and he is hopeful that state senators will pass this bill during this year's legislative session out of the Senate where it died last year. Live in studio, Riley Benson, Count on Two.